what's going on guys welcome back to bear with me so let's see what's in this secret voodoo room oh king is here all banged up Man, took took you long enough why do people keep telling me that she's gone dead i figured as much they really did a number on you it it was mills that back stabbing son of a <clears throat> hang in there I'll call for help. Come on, Tit. We both know this is the end of the line. I see you and your boys took a lot of them with you. Must have been one hell of a fight. <sighs> it was only... Okay. Is she... <sighs> she's fine. But seeing as she's in their hands now, she won't be fine. <laughs> for long. What about your candle there? I thought you were protected. Uh, I... I couldn't get the damn thing to work. Only she can... Tigran? Where is she? Oh, who knows? It's near impossible for her to settle down dead. She's as wild as they come. It's what I loved about her the most. What were you trying to accomplish, King? <sighs> I made a mistake, Bear. I... was afraid. I thought... I... if I hand the girl over to the Red Men... The city would be safe. But she is the city. Without her, there's nothing. And Mills? Mills has gone insane. It was him who burned down the mill, Ted. I had my suspicions. And he tried to pin it on you. Why? There's no honor among thieves, Bear. We had a gentleman's agreement. About the elections. But I guess that pig likes to run unopposed. He was meeting with the red man behind my back all the while, pretending to be <laughs> concerned about her well-being. He doesn't care for the girl to it, only himself. So now what? They're handing her over to Red? Is that the plan? I really don't know. Although, that sounds about right, Ted. Yeah. Uh, this vault behind me. You'll find everything in there. There's enough dirt in that vault to put Mills away for good. Make sure you give that evidence to someone you can trust. To someone you know. Rest now. I'll rest you when I'm dead. God damn it. We never got along. But I have to hand it to you, King. You turned out to be a bigger man than anyone in this entire hellhole of a town, King. Oh, his candle went out. Look on my works, ye mighty in despair. Seems like there's a key on him. Okay. I guess he kept it as a reminder of Tigran. So now we have four keys. It looks like there are four keyholes on this thing. They're all just squiggly lines, goddammit. Yeah, but that would be water, earth, fire, and I'm guessing air. Oh, well, they are faint on this thing. So. Here we go. That's the fire key. Maybe a lock would be a better place for a key. Just saying. Okay, okay. Relax. Water. Two more to go. Love key. Air key. Maybe a lock would be a better place for a key. Just saying. Almost there. That's the love key. So are we still missing something? That, or, you know, use it in the lock. Okay. Jeez, chill. Hey, these lines I get, it's a heart.
It's usually where the key goes. Yeah, I get it. But how do I get out of here? Okay, let's reset this. So this unlock something. Unlock something else. That locks it more. Hmm. Okay. So something tells me um I should go back up and find the last key. Because ritual altar is fine. Nothing else we can look at down here. Okay, we'll have to go find the last key. Only books, secret Buddha room, more books. Still in one piece. Oh, sort of. Living room. It's gotta be something somewhere, right? A lot of dead policemen. It's gotta be one more key somewhere. I'm not really into pottery. It's nice, I guess. I need to find the earth key. Could it be hidden outside somewhere? It's a nice wall. That's one big pineapple. Hmm. Oh, the vase is broken. I did not see that before. Please tell me there's an earth key here. Hmm. There seems to be a key inside. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Fine. Okay. So now I guess we just have to turn these in the right order. Back down. Yeah. Okay, that's the keys. Now what? Hmm. Okay. That unlocks that thing. Okay. Oh, that reset all of them. Hmm. 
Hmm. So that's day turned. Okay. What? Yeah, because that was in. Okay. So that has to be the first one, I'm guessing. No. Why is it a different color then? No idea what that is. No idea. Four of them sticking out. That's definitely not right. Okay. And no. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. I have no idea. This is... We haven't found any clues or anything. Okay, so that takes away a tooth, that takes away a tooth, that does, and that does, okay. Um, that does, are we getting luckier this time? I don't know, maybe. Yeah. Come on, please. Damn it. Hmm. Okay. Nope. Hmm. Oh, yes. Finally. Easy peasy. Well, not really. Tons of evidence. Holy bunch of baggage, Batman. Oh, it didn't say. Why did it say it? Oh, evidence suitcase. It says pig on it. I'd place my bet on this one. Yep, let's take it. I'll hold on to it so it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. Anything else we can take in here? Evidence suitcase? Hmm. Just a whole lot of evidence. Oh. Ah, okay. Reef King. Yeah, he turned into uh, he turned into a inflatable shark.
<laughs> okay, that's actually quite funny. Sad that he died though, but that, that is that is funny. Okay, I'm guessing we're getting off this island then. I hope the take was worth Yeah, so nothing... Nothing else... We can look at. Seaside entrance, there we go. Yeah, I should hurry before he gets too drunk to drive me back. Let's hurry then. Maybe you should move a bit faster than Ted. What happened? King's dead. Let's go. Dead? Holy barnacle! What about the girl? She's not here. Well, that's good. Did you get my stuff? No, but it doesn't matter anymore. King's dead. Oh, where to now, Bear? Take me back to the shore. Aye, strange night, Bear. It's about to get stranger. King passing away like that made me realize he was the only one of this sinister bunch to show me some integrity in the end. I have to give him some credit for that. Seems like an underwhelming end for the King of Crime, if you ask me double-crossed and shot by the police, even more crooked than he was. I was relieved to hear the doll made it out okay, even though she's in Locke's hands now. With King gone, Mills acquired the rest of the PCPD forces to his side. The power of money has no equal, I guess. I know Locke. I served under him in the Great Pillow War of 38. He's competent, intelligent, disciplined, and the only man in this goddamn city that can actually follow up on his threats. I remember the day he was promoted to the chief of police. I thought he was a great choice. We all did. What a bunch of idealists we were. The years that followed took their toll on Locke. He was becoming more shady in his operations. Soon enough, it was impossible to distinguish his actions from the ones he was so rigorously condemning in his speeches. Now, he's nothing more than a common criminal, a dangerous one at that. With every threat I unravel, the outcome seems more bleak. Not only do I have to worry about a lunatic arsonist in the loose, now I have an entire goddamn police department to deal with. I can't get blindsided by all of this. I still have to find Amber. If what King told me holds any merit, seems logical. Locke would bring the doll back to the precinct for questioning. Just long enough for Red to conveniently find his way there. I have to get there fast, but that means I won't have any time to prepare my next move. It's time to find out if an old bear can still think on his feet. CBG has gone off the radar. I could really use his help right now. Things are finally starting to make some sense, and I use the term very loosely. Mills has gone insane out of fear. Both him and King thought they could use Red for their own gain. It was already too late when it dawned on them. He can't be reasoned with. Red kept on rampaging, and the only way to stop him is to deliver him the only thing he wants. I'm left wondering if Red really gets to Amber, what'll happen then? It feels like I'm running towards a cliff with a blindfold on. But if something happens to the doll in the meantime, will there be a bridge for me at the end? Will there be any bridges left? At all? Okay. So we are at the harbor. We can go back to Tycoon's Lair again. Or the police station. Just see anything left out here. Doesn't seem like it.
Okay, tell you what guys, I am gonna take a break here. When we come back, hopefully we will be able to save Amber. And it feels like we might be getting close to the conclusion here, but I'm still really looking forward to see the finale because I actually think it's a really good story they're telling. But thank you guys so much for watching and be sure to stay tuned for the next one. Until then, take care. Bye.